Hey guys, Dave of My Freedom Smokes here. Today I'm gonna talk to you about something brand new from Indulgence, and that is gonna be the Mutation X V5. That's right, they're on now the fifth edition of the popular and infamous Mutation X RDA. Um, something kind of sets this one apart from the others is they've playing on two of the most popular build deck designs on the market right now, which would be your two post velocity deck and also just actual postless deck. Um, the velocity posts are removable on this one. Uh, we'll dive up close and show you that in a little bit. That's actually a really cool feature about this thing. Um, same basic look of all your Mutation X that we've come to know and love. Uh, they have changed a little bit the way they do the airflow through the cap. It does have top airflow that's adjustable. Um, but the airflow actually runs up through the cap, little slots there, and comes out the top. And that's fully adjustable, different from your side airflow. So that's a really cool design they've thrown in there so you can really open up all your airflow for your cloud chasing needs or you can close it all off and it really excels as a flavor RDA in that aspect. Uh, it comes with a nice wide board drip tip but you do get your 510 adapter if you want to use your favorite 510 style drip tip. I'll show you a little bit of what's actually in the box with it. You get your nice trusty well-known little blue screwdriver set of uh, an Allen key extra screws for both your velocity deck to remove it and your actual adjustment screws, O-rings, out the wazoo. <laughs> you get your nice quality assurance card. It shows us past quality checklist there. And you do get an extra deck insulator. It's a little ceramic insulator, which like I said, we'll show you that up on the up close. Basically, just use that whole deck as surrounded by an insulator so they can make it where it can be a, a velocity style or a postless deck. Um, this thing's got great airflow on it. It's, I usually keep it more open for the, uh, the cloud chasing because I'm more about having a big vapor than the actual flavor. So. You definitely get the slotted airflow holes. You got nine of them on each side, and it's got the angular adjustment so it closes off the holes row by row. Actually, I should say column by column. <clears throat> See, that's a really cool little RDA. Cotton's a little dry there. Let me throw some more liquid on there. I'm running in the Velocity two post design right now. Little dual coil build in there. Looking at some of the pictures in the book, you can get really insane with some of the coils. They're showing a six coil design with two coils on each set of holes for the velocity and then another coil that goes into the postless holes. You see here on the sides here, you got your adjustment holes for uh, when you tighten in your leads on your postless. And then you obviously got your velocity style deck there. Not a very deep juice well, but I've noticed that a lot with postless style RDAs is the juice wells aren't really that deep. Um, so you just wanna make sure that you're not oversaturating your cotton with liquid, because of course it's gonna run out on you. And they do cover that in the book, because there is naturally with any RDA, especially the ones with the airflow tunnels like that, vapor will get trapped, it'll turn back into liquid and kind of leak out. And I've heard people talk about thinking, concerns with this thing leaking, and that's usually what it is, it's just Maybe a little vapor got trapped in there and get a couple of droplets as it cools off. Nothing too big to be concerned with. I haven't had any issues with leaking or anything like that. So yeah, this uh, Mutation X V5 is a real good RDA for somebody that just likes to get kind of creative with their builds. Uh, it's dual purpose for people looking for a flavor chaser or a cloud chaser. It's gonna be a great all around RDA for anybody out there. So, um, have a little toke here and then we're going to check up the up close on it. Alright, so here we see the Indulgence Mutation X V5 deck up up close and personal. You see you got your two velocity styled posts and you notice there's screws around there. Those are the screws you want to take out when you want to make this a post list RDA. So I'm going to take those out for you real quick. Just little small Phillips head screws comes right out of there, get them nice and loose, and deck comes, or post comes right off the deck. Do the same thing on the other side. 
I did go ahead and pre-loosen these a little bit just to make it a little quicker for our film. So trying to get them out. So there we go, and those pop right out. And now you'll see you have your uh, your two positive, or sorry, those are actually the grounded side. Your two negative posts there, and your two positive posts here. So you don't put one lead here, one to there, and same on that side. And you see you do get your little ceramic insulator I mentioned, which is that part right there. You do got a little center section there. I can show you that as well, uh, how to take that off and get to that ceramic. Um, you got your adjustment for your leads. Like I said, your leads go in there. And there's a little Allen key in there that comes out for the adjustment. You just get it out just like that. You don't need to take them all the way out. You just run your leads in there and you'll tighten that screw back down. All right. Tighten that back up and I'll take the RDA off the device here. And you'll see it does have an adjustable 510 on there. You can take the end cap part off of it. That's the adjustable part there. Set that off the side. If you look, there's actually a slotted section down in there. I find a three millimeter screwdriver fits the best. You just thread that out. Come on out of there. And right, there's the screw that holds all that in place. And then your deck will actually come off there. And once you get those screws out of there, you'll be able to take the uh, your ceramic insulator off and put a replacement on for some reason if you were to crack that one or break it. Take the screws right out. All right, come on out of there. Okay. One and two. All right, give it a little push. Come on out of there. Grab my tweezers here. There we go, and it pops out. And then you're just able to put your new one back on there if you need to. I'm just going to keep the same one on there because there's nothing wrong with that one. Do the process in reverse. You just pop that back in there. Get in there. There we go. Actually, I do need to replace. I actually cracked that one. <laughs> so I'm going to put the new one back on. And you want to be gentle with these because ceramic can break easily if you're not careful. See, that one slips in much easier. There might have been something wrong with that one to begin with. Put that back in place. Put the screw back in the bottom. And then you get your adjustable 510 screw. Put that on the back. There you go. You put that right back in there. Yeah, if I quit dropping it. <laughs> there we go. And there it is. There's your hostless post for the Mutation XV5. If you want to throw your velocity post back on, you just sit them right there. And they're right into the little slots. And you tighten your screws down, you're good to go. Post almost all the way in. All right. Find my last screw and we'll have the same back together. There we go. So there you have it. That's the up close on the Indulgence Mutation X V5. If you have any questions about the RDA, you can leave them in our comments below. As always, this has been David with My Freedom Smokes. Thank you for vaping.